Good afternoon to you. It is cut down day in the NFL and we are following this developing story with the Browns here at Sports for CLE Studios. Browns still have a few more uh, moves to make to get to the mandated 53-man roster by 4 o'clock this afternoon, but uh, the moves keep coming in. All of these are via reports from various NFL and uh, local uh, beat reporters. So uh, a couple of the surprise names, uh, the Browns have waived Kaderil Hodge, making him a free agent, as well as Porter Gustin. Really, no huge surprises, but those are two of the bigger names. Here is uh, who the Browns have reportedly waived so far. Defensive linemen Curtis Weaver, Marvin Wilson, Porter Gustin, and Cameron Malvo. Linebackers, T.J. Scales, Elijah Lee, Willie Harvey. Defensive backs, Sheldrick Redwine, Javante Moffitt, Elijah Benton, Brian Allen, and Manny Ragamba. Offensive lineman, Colby Gossett. Running back, uh, John Kelly, who looked pretty good in the preseason. Quarterback, Kyle Laletta. Tight ends, Jordan Franks and Kyle Markway. Wide receivers, JoJo Natson and Kaderil Hodge and fullback Johnny Stanton. Remember, some of these guys could come back onto the practice squad. Um, also, Greg Sennett, offensive tackle, headed to the injured reserve list. Uh, the Browns are also reportedly interested in bringing in Nick Mullins, who had some experience starting uh, last year with the San Francisco 49ers. He could be a backup quarterback, potentially a practice squad type quarterback for the Browns. Again, reports that the Browns are talking to quarterback Nick Mullins. Uh, we will have the latest on this developing story as the Browns get down to 53 man. That roster limit mandated by the NFL has to be done by 4 o'clock today. Uh, Greg or Jeff Phelps along um, with Tim Bielek to talk all about the roster moves and the Browns roster. We'll see you at 4 o'clock on Sports for CLE right here.